All right, 1.45 in the morning and I'm still up. I'm still up because I'm still excited about what took place yesterday. Yesterday I was officially nominated on the ballot for Georgetown for the upcoming election. And let me tell you something, I'm as happy as can be. And guess what? I just want to say thanks. Thanks to all you guys that have been supporting me over the last couple months um, through your messages on Facebook, your private messages, your emails, your messages on BBM, WhatsApp, um, phone calls, seeing me in person. It's been overwhelming and I can't do it without you. And I have to admit that. I'm just one man, but I'm not here for myself. I'm here for you all. So come May 22nd, 54 days away, you all have a chance to turn this country around, to bring back the middle class, to improve the way that you all live, you know, to stop worrying about whether you're going to find money for food on the table or to pay your light bill, you know, um, you know, jobs, you know, why is it that there's 2,000 people that are out of work for a country that has thousands upon thousands of work permit holders? We need to change all this stuff, guys. We need to change it for the better. You guys deserve nothing less but the best when it comes from your representative. Now, I'm just one, and I'm asking you to save a vote for me. But what I'm also asking you to do is give me five guys I can work with. Give me five guys that I can team up with to make this island better when it comes to improving the lives of you guys in Georgetown. But not only that, I'm speaking to all you Caymanians. We have 18 seats available. 18 people that can take this country, take it by the horn, turn this bull around, and charge it in the right direction. But we can't do it without you guys going to the polls May 22nd and doing what needs to be done. And that's to vote the right way has nothing to do about voting for parties or independents, straight or whatever. You vote from the heart. You vote for 18 people that you think will take this country and be your representatives. Not, not dictators. We've had enough of that. You know, not people that are out here for just themselves and for all the glory they can get. But people that are here for you. Times have changed, K-Man. Politicians have changed. There's a new breed of politicians out there. I'm just but one of them. But there's 17 others that are out there in that field of 58 that can get the job done. And that's the whole thing. This is not impossible to do. The job can get done. But it takes you as the voter to go out there and make the difference. So all I'm asking you guys is to give it a chance. Get with the plan. Let's stick with the plan. And let's move forward. The Matthew 2013 campaign is in full gear. And trust me guys, your support is going to keep this train going all the way to the steps of the L.A. And it doesn't stop there. Because once elected, you guys have loaned me. And that's right, you haven't given it to me. And it's nothing that I've, you know, that I've achieved. It's something that I've been loaned. I've been loaned your trust for four years. I got four years to make it happen. I got four years to make you guys realize that you made the right choice. I got four years to turn this island around. And I'm going to work with whoever gets in there with me. But I want to thank you guys. I want to thank you guys. I want to say, you know what? This is still the country, best place in the world. It's our home, your home, my home, so let's make it better. Get with a plan. Matthew 2013. That's me, you, good night.